Past volcanic eruptions in Yellowstone National Park have been global disasters. Now, scientists are trying to predict how this time bomb will explode or go off. This sleeping giant is located in the western United States. Although it stirs occasionally, it hasn't awakened from its slumber for nearly 70,000 years. But when it finally awakens, it may roar and move with unprecedented force. This giant is a supervolcano located beneath Yellowstone National Park, a vast nature preserve and forest that stretches across the states of Wyoming, Idaho, and Montana. The volcano itself is actually located in northwestern Wyoming, where most of Yellowstone is located. The ground above the Yellowstone supervolcano sits on a hot spot made of molten and semi-molten rock called magma. As magma enters the magma chamber, or reservoir, located about 6 to 10 kilometers, 4 to 6 miles, beneath the park, the ground swells. As the magma begins to solidify and cool, the ground collapses. Volcanologists, who have been measuring this activity since 1923, say the ground rose about 25 centimeters, 9.8 inches, between 2004 and 2009. However, in 2010, the ground began to sink. This period of slow, steady rise has many scientists wondering whether Yellowstone will erupt anytime soon. And if it does, there are concerns about how large the eruption will be. The big question is, if Yellowstone started shaking tomorrow, what would happen? Said Dr. Steve Anderson, a volcanologist and professor of earth sciences at the University of Northern Colorado. I don't think we know exactly what would happen. While scientists may not know exactly what will happen, they have an idea, and most say it's likely not the end of the world.
Over the past decade, the volcano has been rising at the fastest rate ever recorded. Yellowstone also experiences an average of between 1,000 and 3,000 earthquakes per year. Most are barely noticeable, with magnitudes of three or less. However, these earthquakes give scientists insight into how quickly the magma chamber beneath the park is filling. The increase in shaking and rumbling throughout the park may indicate that new magma has recently entered the reservoir. Even with the increase in earthquakes, scientists do not consider the rumbling in the magma chamber to pose an imminent threat. However, this is because humans have not yet been around to fully analyze everything that is happening at Yellowstone. Currently, Yellowstone is dormant, with scientists monitoring its every hiccup or cough to predict its next move. Although the forces generated beneath the National Park have persisted for thousands of years, Yellowstone's dormancy doesn't mean it won't awaken someday. The question remains, when and with what force? <laughs> 